Hi guys, today I will show you how to do basic facial for the state Washington test. So first of all, you will listen to the doctor, they talk about the rules and then after that, they're gonna give you 25 minutes. So the rules keep changing. So now you have 25 minutes, you may begin. So first of all, you step back and then whenever you hear, you may begin. So you step in. First thing, you always sanitize your hand. And after that, I'm going to wrap this one to cover my client. And then put the headband on. Be gentle. So remember you have 25 minutes just so you have to do very slowly and allocate your time. So after I uh, finish to wrap my client, and then I'm gonna send aside my hand again. First of all, I'm gonna pick up the makeup removal. So this is called makeup removal. And then I'm gonna use um, the cotton. So I'm gonna clean my client eye and the chin. So make sure when you um, pull everything, you put it on the side like this, and then you squeeze, okay. And because of this is a, your test, so you have to close the cap carefully. Now I'm gonna clean the eyes, eyes. And then I'm gonna throw it in the trash. And then I'm gonna take another cotton. So make sure I'm gonna clean her mouth. Clean the lipstick. Close this again. And always brace your hand like I'm gonna do like this. Throw it in the trash again. So I would say this is the rule. So whenever you touch on the trash, you have to sanitize your hand. But if you not uh, touch on the trash, so you don't need to. So I don't want you to feel like too stretching, like because they're okay, I forgot to sanitize your hand, okay? So, okay, sanitize your hand. And uh, after makeup removal, this is called cleanser. Now I'm gonna apply the cleanser on entire face of my client. So uh, let's open it, put it on the side, and squeeze a little bit. So make sure you put a little bit, not too much. Enough amount is perfect, and close the cap again. And then I'm gonna um, doing like this to make sure the product is gonna be warm. So rub, rub, rub. And uh, remember, at school, I always train the student, so you have to exercise, put your finger like this, so you're gonna do apply, put both hand. Step one, both hand, move. The finger going up, going up, going up, and put on the nose a little bit, the nose on a little bit, and go back to the temple. So after I go back to the temple, I'm gonna maintain the contact. So make sure you do correctly, you have to maintain the contact. Okay, so I'm gonna hold this uh, hand right on the left hand side. I'm gonna put this one down, down. And then I'm gonna use the thumb. I'm gonna move in, clean the chin. Because I my job is have to clean entire face. So I'm gonna clean the chin. And then clean. Okay, true, clean the chin. And then I'm gonna move my finger in and out in and out, big circle, small circle, so you're gonna make in and out, see? I'm gonna dip inside her face like this, and I'm gonna clean, going up, then I'm gonna clean the nose, circle. I would like to recommend during the test, you have to do twice, okay? So put your hand again, down here, down here, and then I'm gonna clean again. Same thing, twice. And make sure you move your um, finger the same rhythm. Don't go too fast, don't go too slow. Don't go fast and slow. This, yeah, okay, in and out and in and out. Same thing, clean the nose, clean the nose, and then go back to the temple. 
So at this moment, my hand is very slippery. First thing, I'm going to clean my hand. All right, so after I clean my hand, I'm throwing this in the trash again, sanitize. So what is the next step? Wipe out. So uh, let me tell you at home, you have to um, put all the water, make sure it's wet before you're taking the test. So, and then all the sponges have to be wet also. So sponges and towel have to be wet at home. All right, so next step is gonna wipe out. So after I'm cleansing her face, entire face, I'm gonna clean her face uh, with um, wet sponges, okay? And everything have to be uh, labeled nice and clean and make sure you could put everything nice and clean. All right, so now I'm gonna clean my client by the wet sponge. So make sure you move correctly. You see? One, two, three, four. Back to the temple. And then throw it in the trash again. Stop. So the next step is going to be exfoliate. So after cleansing, I'm going to use exfoliate. How do I use exfoliate? Okay, so and then do you know what is exfoliate for? Exfoliate is to remove the dead skin. So make sure you're not going to burn your client by exfoliate. So you have to do correctly. Go slowly and then go correctly. All right, okay, so let's step, um, let's do the next step. Exfoliate. I'm going to put it on the side and then close this. So rub, 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 apply, 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 apply. Back to the tempo. And then at this time, I'm going to keep my hand right here too. So I'm going to use this one, go very, very slow and go twice, okay? Because I have 25 minutes. And then go slowly. Go back to here again. Very slow. And make sure you're gonna do the same rhythm. You can do a little bit on the nose, a little bit on the nose. In and out, in and out. And make sure you look at your client like you are serving the real customer. Okay, so I'm going to throw this one into to be disinfectant if I want to use this again. Okay. So my hand is going to slippery again. So let's clean your hand with a paper towel. And put on the trash, sand the hand again. So now I'm going to steam uh, the customer with the steam towel because of during the test, it's not like regular uh, customer, so you have to steam by the machine, but now you're going to steam the customer by wet towel. So where do I put this one? This one in the trash. Okay, so I'm going to do this, and then I'm going to make sure I'm going to test a little bit. Okay, so test. And then I'm open this. And then I'm going to put it in her chin. Now it's... One of the steps, very important, like, see, I'm going to slowly put the customer on the chin right here, and then I'm flip the towel opposite. There you go. There you go. Opposite. Oh, send. make sure you open the mouth and the nose uh, like this, okay? So do it correctly and beautiful. And then I'm going to hold it. Go slowly and take a look at my client. All right, so after I uh, steam my customer with the wet towel, now I'm going to clean and I'm going to roll 
clean and roll and clean and roll. And open my hand like this, and then uh, this is uh, you're gonna put it on soil and linen because a um, towel is gonna be uh, cleaning. Okay, put on soil and linen. Okay, sanitize my hand again. And the next step is um, to, to be sure after I use um, um, the steam towel, then I'm gonna wipe out again to make sure it's clean. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then twist, turn. Put in the tempo and trash. Okay, so finish for the exfoliate. The next step is massaging. So massaging is very important. So during the time you're taking the test, um, the state Washington asking the student have to perform an for massage technique. So um, I recommend you have to apply like Influrat, Pesitrat, Tapamon, and Variation. So um, let's do it. So let's apply the massage cream. Put it on the side again. Rock. Now I'm going to apply. So make sure you maintain the contact. One of the steps, very important, is uh, the step first one is apply, and then I'm going to massage in and out. In and out. OK, and then go back. You see, in and out. Touching and pressing. And then maintain the contact, go down. Put your hand, go down. And then the next step, we're going to do passive thrust. Kneading and squeezing. Go down. So you see, I go twice. And then the last step is tapperman. So make sure four finger you're going to touch on the client and tapping real. And you hear the sound. So the last step is going to vibration. So I'm going to use a vibration technique. Going down. The most important, you keep the same rhythm again. Don't go fast and then go slow and go fast and go slow. So go the same rhythm. Back to the temple. And now, I'm going to wipe out again. So let's do wipe out. The next step is going to massage, and then you're going to wipe out, wipe out, and then you're going to apply the mask. So make sure you're going to put the mask on the jar. Then put the mask on. Do not put too much. Just put enough amount you need and put everything back again. So make sure this area is going to be nice and clean. So now I'm going to apply the mask on my client. Apply. So make sure the, all the products not getting on the customer eyes or nose, like a nostril right like here is really bad. So you apply entire face. OK, 
because you have a lot of time, so make sure you do slowly and, and spread it evenly. If you feel anywhere you're not doing evenly, so you spread it out. So during the time you're taking the test, so everything have to be applied for upward or outward. Make sure you do upward and outward. So this is contaminates. I'm going to throw this in the trash. All right. I'm going to send, I'm going to tie my hand. And now I'm going to wipe out uh, with the wet sponge again. So now a lot of students ask me, how do I pass the test or how do I not pass the test? I would say if you leave a lot of product on the customer, so the proctor is going to uh, give you a low score. But if you are do carefully, like you see her face, and then you have to take a look at that, and then you know clean her face. Make sure you clean, like no more product on the customer face. You see it like if I see it, I still have the product, so I'm gonna turn the other side. And the way you are doing that, they can tell how much you care for your client. So you pat the test easily. You see, now I don't, I check no more product on my client. And going up and going up and going up. Put it back to the temple and throw this one on the trash. Almost done for the test. So now I'm going to apply the toner. So when you apply the toner, um, put it on the side again. So make sure you don't touch on the cap like this. It's a contaminate, you know, it's going to be virus during the time of COVID. It's not really good for the test you are um, practicing. So I'm going to uh, put a little bit, but uh, no, I'm going to put it on the cotton. Two cotton pieces. Okay, apply and close and put it back. So make sure everything you have to close and put it back on the same place. I'm going to dab. Because I make sure I'm going to do like 20 minutes or 18 minutes. So I'm not going to do really fast, just low. So make sure my client have enough toner and a little bit here. Okay, relax. Now, last step is moisturizer. How do I apply moisturizer? Very easy though. Tiny bit right here, close. Dab. And make sure the face is a little bit shiny and press it evenly. And take a look at her. Okay, so I'm done. I'm gonna clean thing. And now I'm gonna take care of all the thing right here. So if if you take the test, if you still have a loss of time, so the examiner will walk through your test and then they see. So you can step back, send a high hand, always send a high before and after. And then uh, after they check it, and then they leave, and then you can clean. Or like when you finish and then you have a lot of time, you can clean uh, this area too. So the most important is that when you, whenever you put the gloves on your hand, then when you take it off, make sure you always sanitize your hand. Make sure it's correctly disinfectant the table, take it off and clean your hand uh, right away, right at that moment. Thank you very much and good luck for you.